Tobey Maguire officially reveals why he finally decided to pick up the phone and start a conversation with Kevin Feige and Amy Pascal in regards to returning in Spider-Man No Way Home. Hello, I like money. Actually, there's way more beyond that, but yeah, that's also a factor. So this comes at us from Deadline, who recently got to talk to Tobey Maguire and ask him multiple things in regards to finally returning as Spider-Man after being away from the role for more than a decade. And of course, they get into the conversation about the character, what it meant to play that character again, all that time away. And ultimately, they start to focus on why exactly did you decide that right now was the time? Now again, I used a hello, I like money clip, but Tobey Maguire honestly doesn't need Spider-Man. If he never would have returned, he would still be one of those super wealthy actors that never has to act again, and it wouldn't even matter, right? Like, Spider-Man is going to add an amount of money to him that is honestly pointless that he'll never notice because that's how rich he is from the other three Spider-Man films. So again, you know, I use that clip jokingly, so it's not really about that. But what he says is, is when the conversation started with Amy Pascal, who of course represents Sony and Spider-Man, and Kevin Feige, representing Spider-Man and Marvel Studios, he said that to him, artistically, the story that they pitched worked. And he knew that the people working on it, once he started talking to them, cared about Spider-Man. And that both of the people, Amy and Kevin, were so passionate about making this possible, and that this wasn't going to take away from Tom Holland's Spider-Man, that he saw the love that everybody was pouring into this, and he wanted to be a part of it. And he says that he was also a fan of what he's seen so far in regards to the other Spider-Man. From seeing Andrew Garfield's version to seeing what Tom Holland has done. And how the story's shaping up and what they're doing. And just talking to everybody and how historic it would be if they were to make this a reality. And he decided that if there was every time where he wanted to come back as Spider-Man, that this would be it because everything here kind of makes sense. Especially that it's not one of those evil studio just push out the sequel and again that's kind of what pushed him out of spider-man 4 and what pushed andrew garfield out was the films were happening because studio mandate like there was no questions about when spider-man 4 had to start production when he was working on it because every single setback was another little notch off of the hey now you can't meet your deadline we're regaining spider-man and they always had to push forward in a quick sort of manner he didn't have that now. He saw everybody working together for the love of the character and said, you know what? It's time. I want to be a part of it because I love that character as well. And that's quite awesome. You know, um, Tobey Maguire kind of opening up about why he's finally returned all starts to make sense. 